AB&I Foundry is the largest producer of cast iron soil pipe and fittings west of the Rocky Mountains. Since the founding over 100 years ago, AB&I has not only grown into a major producer of drain, waste, and vent products, but has also become a leading innovator in environmentally responsible manufacturing and team member safety. In the wake of the great San Francisco earthquake of 1906, Joseph Biscacci in his backyard in Oakland, California, started AB&I Bounty. At that time, AB&I's primary products were small cast iron and brass castings, such as sash weights. Just prior to World War II, AB&I moved to its current location on San Leandro Street to become a high production cast iron foundry. During World War II, for the war effort, AB&I produced nine ton submarine net weights to protect West Coast harbors such as San Francisco. It was in that era that Joseph Biscacci's son, Arnold Biscacci, began leading AB&I to become the innovative and technology leader of the industry that we are today. It's in that era that we became the foundry of the future. In the 1970s, Arnold's son, Alan Biscacci, took over the foundry and led AB&I to becoming the innovative technology and participatory management leader that it is today. Today, Abe and I is led by Kurt Winner, who has furthered Abe and I's tradition of producing innovative technology, high quality products, commitment to team member involvement, and environmental stewardship. Abe and I's manufacturing system consists of three major production processes scrap iron melting and holding, the pipe production process, and the fittings and custom casting production line. Scrap iron is the primary raw material used by AB&I. The foundry uses thousands of tons of scrap iron every month in the manufacturing process, making AB&I a leading recycler of iron. This iron is tested for radiation contamination before melting, a requirement of the CISP 301 standard. The melting of the iron takes place in the cupola. This scrap iron is conveyed, along with coke and limestone, to the foundry's five-story cupola, where the iron is melted. The air around the cupola is constantly filtered, and team members adhere to strict safety standards as part of AB&I's demanding environmental, health, and safety program. In the cupola, scrap iron is layered with coke and limestone, to create the proper chemistry for melting. Air is metered into the chamber and the molten iron is routed to various locations throughout the foundry for use in production. Once melted, the iron is moved to a holding furnace. Here, the iron is stored in liquid form until needed for production. Iron from this furnace is used in the making of pipe, fittings, and custom castings. Iron is tested in AB&I's laboratory to ensure quality. Thorough spectrographic and physical testing at the time of manufacture ensures that AB&I iron meets all standards for chemical composition, tensile strength, and durability. Results of these tests are carefully logged and archived for future reference and are verified by both NSF International and the Cast Iron Soil Pipe Institute. AB&I pipe and fittings are also listed by IAPMO and conform to the Uniform Plumbing Code. Team member health and safety is a top priority at AB&I and all foundry personnel undergo ongoing safety training. AB&I's outstanding record demonstrates that management's commitment to safe practices translates directly to a better, healthier production environment for the team. Cast iron pipe has been the main product manufactured in the foundry for over half a century. AB&I pipe is produced in specially designed centrifugal pipe machines. In the beginning of the pipe casting process, slurry is injected into the pipe machine and spun at high speeds. A measured amount of molten iron is then poured from the boot into the pipe machine, which distributes the iron evenly to ensure uniform wall thickness of the pipe. Once fully formed, the white hot pipe is pulled from the machine and placed onto a conveyor for cooling and transporting to the pipe dip for finishing. 
This centrifugal pipe casting technology produces pipe of superior and consistent quality. Pipe finishing is the final step in the production process. Once pipe is sufficiently cooled for finishing, it is dipped into an environmentally friendly coating material for final sealing. When cooled even further, the pipe ends are painted silver and the pipe is marked with the ABNI name, date of manufacture, country of origin, and the NSF, CISPI, and UPC marks. All ABNI cast iron pipe has been third-party certified by NSF International, confirming compliance with the Cast Iron Soil Pipe Institute 301 standard. Finished pipe is then stored for shipping. Finished pipe and fittings are stored in the shipping area until used to fill customer orders. ABNI is proud of its outstanding record of filling virtually all orders 100%, with back orders the rare exception. ABNI's commitment to our contractors and our distributors is that you will have the highest quality product in the industry, the greenest product in the industry, and the unwavering commitment from a team of professionals dedicated to your success and your business. In addition to pipe, ABNI also manufactures fittings and custom castings. The production of these products begins in the pattern shop. In the pattern shop, craftsmen and technicians blend art and science to create the original patterns needed for the production of molds. These patterns form the basis for every casting produced in the foundry, except pipe. Molds form the exterior shape of the casting, but cores create the hollow interiors. Core room team members create hundreds of sand cores every hour. These cores will be mated up with their associated molds later in the manufacturing process. The DESA molding machine is where it all comes together. When producing fittings or custom castings, molds are produced in the DESA molding machine. For hollow castings, Team members load sand cores into the DESA. These cores are then married up with their associated molds and conveyed to the pouring stations for final casting. In making castings, a pattern first imprints the shape of the casting onto sand, producing a mold. The core is then mounted onto this mold and the molten iron is poured so that it completely surrounds the core. As the iron cools, the sand from the core and the mold fall away, leaving the almost finished casting. Both fittings and custom castings are manufactured in this way. Cast finishing is the final step in production. Fittings and custom castings are processed through a series of shaking and turning machines designed to remove sand left over from the manufacturing process. Discarded sand is recycled for future use. Castings are then conveyed to the finishing area for final grinding and quality control. They are then packaged into sturdy ABNI boxes or custom packaging according to the needs of the customer and transported to the storage area. The shipping department is the last stop for fittings and castings. Just as with pipe, Fittings and custom castings are stored for rapid fulfillment of customer orders. Virtually all fittings are available in large quantities and available for immediate shipment. ABNI stocks large inventories of no-hub couplings in both standard and heavy-duty styles. Anaco no-hub couplings are NSF certified to meet the CISPI 310 standard, and the Husky 2000 and 4000 heavy-duty designs are preferred for applications where extra sealing strength is required. When used together, AB and I pipe, fittings, and standard couplings form a fully certified system guaranteed to perform to the very highest industry standards. AB and I plumbing products can be found in hundreds of American landmark buildings, including Alcatraz, the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, and the Oakland Coliseum, just to name a few. Today, ABNI plumbing products are distributed nationwide from four strategically located service centers, putting ABNI products within easy reach of professional plumbers in virtually all 50 states. At ABNI Foundry, in the custom casting division, we do just that. We make a casting, 
custom make it to your specifications. ABNI custom castings can be found in a wide range of products manufactured by dozens of leading companies nationwide. Every foundry claims to be able to deliver good price with good quality. We do too. Excellent price, excellent quality, and excellent delivery. And we can prove it. We've been proving it for 100 plus years. My customer list still proves it, and by all means, you're welcome to examine the customer list and call them and find out for yourself. They enjoy doing business with us. You will too. One thing that truly differentiates AB&I and something that we've been proud about for years is our commitment to service. If there's a problem in the field, we'll have someone out there within 24 hours to work with you to resolve it fairly, equitably, and quickly. AB&I spends millions of dollars every year on our environmental program. AB&I has led the industry in environmental protection since the 1970s. In addition to recycling thousands of tons of scrap iron every year, AB&I makes sure the air and water in the foundry meet the most aggressive government standards. For example, air throughout the foundry is collected through numerous overhead vacuum stations, and the foundry dust is stored in large bag houses. Much of this dust is recycled back into the cupola as an aid in melting. AB&I recycles over 60,000 gallons of processed water an hour. Water used in cooling the cupola and pipe machines is sent to the on-site water treatment plant where contaminants are removed and the water is cooled. Processed water moves from the mixing tank to the clarifier where dirt and other debris are precipitated out in the form of sludge. The water then goes to the settling tank for further cleansing then onto the cooling tower before being returned to the foundry floor for use again in cooling critical melting and pouring stations. Storm water that comes off our roofs and parking lots is filtered before it is discharged into the storm water system. Rainwater is collected in below grade catch basins before being pumped to the filtering system for processing. Storm water enters the system as a murky combination of water, dirt, and other contaminants. Once in the system, storm water is sent to the settling tanks where large particles sink to the bottom and form sludge. The water is then pumped to the filtering systems where it passes through a special medium to remove smaller particles and other contaminants. When the water is clean enough to sustain marine life, some of it is recycled back to the foundry for cooling the cupola, while the rest is discharged AB&I takes its environmental responsibilities seriously and has received numerous awards and special recognitions from the Environmental Protection Agency and other environmental groups. In addition, AB&I products have been granted special ICC ES SAVE certification by the International Code Council in recognition of the over 95% recycled content used in AB&I products. This certification verifies the AB&I products meet specific sustainability targets defined by today's codes, standards, and green ratings. If you really want to see what AB&I is all about, I invite you to come tour the foundry and see why we're considered the most innovative manufacturer, the most team-oriented employer, and provide the greatest value to our customers and why we're considered the foundry of the future. The AB&I team has been producing quality cast iron products right here in America for over 100 years. It's the people that make the difference. AB&I products are manufactured to the highest standards by a team of dedicated professionals who truly care about quality. Tour the foundry. You'll see what a difference a great team can make. AB&I products are manufactured under fair working conditions in a safe and healthy working environment which is free of discrimination and where management is committed to respecting the rights and dignity of our team members.